Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today is really exciting because I'm going to be sharing with you all the new Disney Bound book by Leslie Kay. So this book came out just a few days ago, but I did get a bit of a sneak preview because I'm in it. And that is so, so exciting. And I'm so thankful for all of you who support me and my work and Leslie and Disney for this amazing opportunity to be part of this beautiful book. So if you guys aren't familiar with Disney bounding, it's um, a trend that Leslie Kay, the author of this book, started on Tumblr when she made a blog about creating fashionable outfits inspired by Disney characters. And that's because adults over 14 can't wear costumes at the Disney parks. My friend Colleen from school, she actually made a video about me and my Disney bound journey. So I'll leave the link up on the screen right here so you guys can check out what she did in her interview with me to learn more about this Disney bound trend if you're not super familiar with it. So without further ado, let's take a look at Disney bound dress Disney and make it fashion. We have a lovely introduction by Leslie herself uh, talking about the history of Disney bounding. Oh, so this is pretty interesting. I didn't know about this. Before Lillian was married to Walt, her last name was Bounds. <laughs> it must have been fate. Oh, so chapter one is called Disney bounding steps. And look who's in here. My friend Felicia as Captain Marvel. <laughs> It's so cool that my friends are in here too. It's so exciting. And right after, look who I see. Here's me. <laughs> so page three, and I am here, Disney bounding as Boo from Monsters, Inc. <laughs> I took this photo in front of my bedroom door. That's why it says Aya. So now we're starting to look at specific character ideas, starting with Mickey. Uh, so that's really cool. There's um, the, like these illustrations of outfit um, item ideas. Ooh, we have another full page spread with Sarah and Tiffany. I used to love watching their thingamavlogs YouTube channel. Of course, we have Tracy Hines as Ariel on this page. I find it a little bit hard to do mermaid Ariel bounds because I don't think purple and green go too great together. But there are definitely some really cute and creative ways that I've seen people tie these colors in. You can even make your own like DIYs for bounds. I just got a plain purple beret on Amazon and got this patch on Etsy by this one was from Gnome Depot. A really cute custom tangled beret. Leslie is showing bounding around the world and introducing this chapter is Melody as Vanellope from Wreck-It Ralph. So it's really cool that we can see fans from like Disneyland Paris or Alani. <laughs> and here is Francis with Mickey. And we're presenting Hong Kong Disneyland. We have my friend Tessa as Rapunzel. How beautiful is that? We have group bounds, which are really so fun. Uh, this year I did one with my friends Eleanor and Jade and we were the Disney fairies. So that was really, really fun. I found my friend Purnell in here and he says, everyone has a chance to showcase their passion for Disney magic, no matter their color, size, or shape. And I totally agree with that. There's been so much support for bounders of color and people showcasing their culture through um, their bounds. And as you may know, I did my own series of Disney bounding as the Disney princesses with traditional Japanese clothing. And the support for that was so overwhelming. And it really made my heart so happy to see that you guys were so supportive of me showing my culture and Disney bounding in this new way. So that was the Disney bound book by Leslie Kay. I think this book is so cute and so wonderful and so helpful too to get more outfit inspiration and also seeing all these amazing creators out here. I hope you guys enjoy this video and see you later!